Hi, I'm Stuart and welcome to Sarnet Television. I'm joined today by... Chris. It's good to see everybody. And we're going to be talking about backup alarms. Well, Chris will be. I'll be basically sitting here relaxing and enjoying myself. But basically, we have a variety of different backup alarms from Echo. We do. It's going to be their 500 series. So a few different options for you to take a look at when it comes to the decibel levels and the voltage that these are going to tie into. Now, again, they look similar. They all look similar. Yes. So they're all going to have the same unique, well, I shouldn't say unique, same standard looking housing across the five that we're offering on the product page. So with that, the internals are going to be the variable. Okay. So we let Chris go across and start his presentation with respect to the Echo series of backup alarms. Thank you, Stuart. From Echo Safety Group, we offer you their 500 series backup alarms. On the product page for the 500 series backup alarms, you'll notice a drop down menu, and that is going to allow you to select which of these five models will suit your application. There's the 510, 520, 530, 575 and 585 for the part numbers. So differences between these is going to carry over to their operating voltage, so tying it into the vehicle and its electrical system based upon 12 volt or the need to have 12 to 24 volt voltage range. So product specs and all the details will carry over onto the bottom of the page for you to take a look at. The decibel levels that these offer you are also going to change with that appropriate model number. So make sure to take a look at that as well. Depending on what your requirements are and how much noise you're needing to keep the vehicle operator and work environment safe and up to code, they range between 97 decibels up to 102, maxing at 107. With these series of backup alarms, installation is going to be quite a breeze. Only one that is a little different in the family is going to be this here, the 575, and that uses a conventional two-wire electrical connection. On the other four, it is going to require one wire, and that is a positive connection into your vehicle's electrical system, tying into the reverse trigger or backup light. How they will ground is taking advantage of the bottom stud here, and that carries over to the aluminum bracket, contouring down to the side and the mounting base. So that will take care of the ground strapping for this. So just a matter of installing it onto your vehicle. With these fixtures, they are rough and tumble, so they are going to survive the harsh conditions that you will put them through. And on the back, to protect all the electronics and safety internals, a very nice epoxy coating. To give you a demonstration at the tone that the Echo 500 series backup alarms can offer, go ahead and put some power over here again to the model 575. So for those of you behind this cameras and across the studio, make sure to grab the earmuffs. So with the shifting into reverse, There you have it, the echo backup alarm tone that we are all used to when it comes to the conventional sound. Echo Safety Group and our offerings from their 500 series family of backup alarms. Well, there you have it. A interesting presentation, Chris. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. The 500 series of backup alarms from Echo, or the Echo 500 series is a better way to say that. It's not 500 series, it's a series which the number begins with 500. Exactly. See, I'm quite clever with numbers. This is Chris. This is Stuart. <laughs> Thanks for watching Saturday Television. Have a great day.